Sora and Guild both got their back blings in the shop. We have the gold chain and also the goldy lock back bling. So we're going to find some outfits that go well with them. Thank you guys so much for watching and let's get sweaty. Starting with the goldie lock. It's fairly universal in terms of what you can use it on. I don't think that the blue gems really ruin any of these combos for me as it's very minimal, but you could stretch a little bit of the blue gems on specific combos. I kind of like on a rapscallion. Kind of looks like she robbed that sack of gold. Um, he's got blue eyes, so the blue gems do come into play here. I know it's a stretch, but the small details can make a difference. I kind of like it on Heidi. Passivat, aka Pinocchio. I'm a real boy. We have it on Gumshoe here. Looks okay with the brown straps that she has for her firearms. Ghoul Trooper. For the other style as well. I like it on the zombie a little bit more than the original. We have Scoundrel in the house. Sergeant Winter. He kind of looks like he might be giving away gold instead of presents. I mean, who wouldn't take gold over a present? I'm just saying. We have the smoke dragon with his, uh, what is it called? It's just called blue with his blue. I like how this looks. The blue edit style. And then this is the regular, which doesn't really do it for me. I like it on the blue though. Summer striker. I don't showcase this a lot because I really don't like it. The armadillo outfit. The assault trooper outfit. Hatch patroller. Jungle scout. High rise assault trooper. Hey seed. Brainiac. Gold Trooper Brainiac. Ara. Scorpion. And Tower Recon. I don't even think I put Guild in here. I'm so sorry. I didn't even put Guild in here. Must favorite my man here and show you the back on him as well. So there it is. Now we have the gold chain back bling on a handful of outfits here. Not a bad back bling either. I like the little pickaxe he has inside of the back bling as well. Midas Midas here. We have the gold agent as well. Once I save, we will see that we're pretty much almost completely covered here. Other than his shoes, I think is the only thing that is not covered and his earpiece. Um, haven't seen them since I've leveled in the past couple of days. Where am I at and why am I down here? Here we are. Raptor again looks pretty good. Spider Knight, kind of a stretch. Paradox, I don't use it a lot, but it looks good on him. Meow School's in the house, yes. And then once he has a little bit of gold on him, very nice. Elite Agent, very sweaty skin. No Helmet Elite Agent as well. The Cloaked Star. Germany, Alpine Ace, looks pretty cool. Velocity and Raptor both look really good. Polar Patroller, I kind of like the vibe. I kind of like it. Raps Kyan again looks pretty cool. Rogue Agent. Scoundrel once again. The Blue Squire. It's got red. It's got gold. It's got like a gray silver. I think it looks good. Blue Team Leader. Armadillo in the house. Royale Knight. Looks really good. My controller's not rotating. Here we go. That looks good. The Hush Outfit. Cutie Pie with the helmet on as well. Chopper looks pretty damn good, actually. That one surprised me. Brawler, kind of a stretch, but it's okay. Assault Trooper again, very universal outfit. Aura, of course, and then the original Aura as well. There we go. Guild. And the original Guild. There he is. The Hard Charger outfit. The Relay outfit. Scorpion. The new default. Um, we have the Tower Recon Specialist. And then the Verge outfit. I kind of liked it on Cutie Pie, actually. That looks pretty good. Also on Choppa. And then the Royale Knight and Blue Squire. Those all look really good. Pretty solid backplings here. I'm liking it so far. Very cool. Don't forget, guys, we did do a combo video for these new Winter Hunter edit styles for Aura and Guild. Thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you nerds on the live stream. See ya!